The Battle of Prelep in the First Balkan War took place on 3 5 November 1912 when the Serbian army encountered Ottoman troops near the town of Prelep, in today's North Macedonia. The clash lasted for three days. Eventually the Ottoman army was overwhelmed and forced to retreat. Bad weather and difficult roads hampered the First Army's pursuit of the Ottomans after the Battle of Kumanovo, forcing the Morova division to move ahead of the Dina division. On 3 November, in the autumn rain, forward elements of the Morova division encountered fire from Kara Said Pasha's V Corps from positions north of Prelep. This started the three-day battle for Prelep, which was broken off that night and was renewed the next morning. When the Dina division arrived on the battlefield, the Serbs gained an overwhelming advantage, forcing the Ottomans to withdraw south of the city. On the 5th of November, as the Serbs moved south of Prelep, they came again under Ottoman fire from prepared positions on the heights of the road to Betula. Bayonets and hand grenades gave the Serbs the advantage in hand-to-hand -hand fighting, but they still required the better part of the day to force the Ottomans to retreat. The overt and guileless nature of the Serbian infantry attacks impressed one Ottoman observer, who noted. The development of the Serbian infantry attack was as open and clear as the execution of a barracks exercise. Large and strong units covered the entire plain. All the Serbian officers were seen clearly. They attacked as if on parade. The picture was very impressive. One part of the Turkish officers were struck dumb by the wonder of this mathematical disposition and order, the other side at this moment because of the absence of heavy artillery. They remarked on the arrogance of the open approach and clear frontal attack. The artillery abandoned in Skoplie would have helped the Ottoman defenders south of Prelep. The Serbs demonstrated the same lack of subtlety in their infantry attacks that caused heavy casualties among all the combatants during the Balkan Wars and would cause many during the First World War. During this battle, the Serbian First Army was without the presence of its commanding general, Crown Prince Alexander. Ill from the rigors of the cold and wet campaign, he maintained telephone contact with his army from his sickbed in Skoplie. The short, sharp battles around Prelep demonstrated that the Ottomans were still capable of opposing the Serbian march through Macedonia. Even after abandoning the city of Prelep, the Ottoman V Corps fought stubbornly south of town. The size and enthusiasm of the Serbs overcame the Ottomans, but at a cost. The Ottomans suffered around 300 dead and 900 wounded, and 152 were taken prisoner, the Serbs had losses of around 2,000 dead and wounded. The road southwest to Betula now lay open to the Serbs.